Oh look, it's a it's a wonderful day to work on the dually, right? You know, no big deal. Oh wait, half my fucking shop is flooded. What the f goes all the way over here underneath my seats, underneath all this sh my trim, my new like new boxes that I new trim that I just got. All the way over here underneath my fucking transmission and jet skis, which can be wet, but what a very uncool way to start today. Oh dude, it's all the way underneath the Mustang. Oh f this is ridiculous, man. I've been at this forever. This sucks. Every time, it seems like no matter what, man, there's always something that's going on in the shop that's stopping me from doing work, whether it's the fucking power getting ranked out of the wall, or maybe the shop's flooding. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave a fan on and try to get this thing dried up in here and try to get the dually dried up because the dually is soaked on the inside because there was a small leak that I had to fix. So I decided I'll give you guys an update on what's going on with the ambulance because it's been a minute since you guys have seen the ambulance. I've got footage that I need to edit and compile into a video, but it's been a long time since you guys seen it in here, so I want to give you an update. Not much has changed with this side of things. You know, with this being finished up, this is ready to be covered in every uh, panel and whatnot. Ham's been working on choosing his color palette, so we got a couple of options here. But uh, the kitchen has been a major, major change. I've built this little cover. This will be nice and epoxied here in a little bit, but uh, this cover covers the stove, so he has a nice cover for him to cut and do stuff on. Got sink all installed, pretty much. Got to do the, uh, the water and stuff like that. Then we actually have like a shower. We have a shower area now. I'm working on this little shelf here. We're gonna put some RGB and stuff in here. There's RGB strips all in here, and that looks really cool. I'm working on covering the wall, bathroom walls. Uh, this is gonna be a cabinet above here. This is like a little cover panel that's gonna cover all the wiring and whatnot. Then you know, little little cover panel up here as well. And that'll nut everything up there. Oh, we got the uh, the floors installed and built for his desk. This is where uh, his feet will kind of like sit when he's at his desk. Still working on this air conditioning cabinet. I've been working with a company trying to figure out what I need for the air conditioning unit, but they've been kind of a pain in the ass and I'm really close to calling them out online because uh, they just won't return my fucking emails. It's not that hard. And I might be a little bit extra salty because my floors are wet. All I seriously need is a parts list or I'll, I told them I'd pay them for their time. like. Fuck. I've got the door out right now so I can finish up some of the wiring, but here's all my wiring harnesses that I've built. This is, it's a little messy right now. I built this little separator here. Really happy with this. And there's some other stuff too, which I do have footage of, but like there's been so much crap going on that I haven't been able to like record or edit most of the stuff. And it's just, I mean, just stuff like the shop flooding. I mean, like that shouldn't, stuff like that shouldn't happen, but it's happening all the time. Oh, let me guess, that's the fucking landlord. So yeah, made a ton of progress, and I do have some of it on camera, which I'm gonna go into now. So if you wanna watch the progress, stick around for the rest of the video, you guys see what I did and how I did it and stuff like that. And before we get started, I am still gonna do my ad. Thank you, Lucy, you've been awesome to work with. Their goal is to provide a much more refreshing alternative to any of your nicotine products. So if you smoke cigarettes or you, you chew dip, you know, that's fine. That's totally fine. I'm not here to make you feel bad about that. I just wanna let you guys know about Lucy, which is an alternative to that. Much more refreshing alternative, you know? But I do wanna say thank you to Lucy for part with me. I know this is an inconventional start, but thank you again for helping me through a, another traumatic shop incident, which is, I mean, like, there's so much fucking water. It comes in a bunch of different flavors, pomegranate, wintergreen, uh, and cinnamon. Uh, cinnamon, anything gives me a headache, so I don't like cinnamon, but the cinnamon flavor is good. I prefer the wintergreen and the pomegranate. They're both delicious. Use the link in my description, all that good stuff. Thank you for sponsoring today's video, Lucy. I'm gonna go home and get really freaking...
making a lot of progress in our kitchen here. The, I, have, I have this uh, this wood trim that goes all the way around the sink area. That's gonna prevent water from, from splashing over if he's washing dishes or something like that. You know, however you wash dishes. You know, be washing dishes, you know what I'm saying? So when he's washing dishes, that'll be there. That'd be, that'd be nice. Um, sink isn't in permanently, I just have it set in there for reference. I'm about to put a cabinet in here soon, etc. Originally I was gonna have a, uh, a thing that opens and closed and covered the sink and be a, like a cover, but I just don't think I'm gonna be able to do that with, with the way I'm gonna do the water system. So I'm, I'm changing how I'm doing that, I'm gonna keep this open. Uh, however, this, this will have a top that opens and closes that'll match with this, and that way I can use it as like a cutting board when he's not using the burners. But I do have this little transition area for him in between his kitchen and his office that I do want to keep open, but I don't want it like, but I don't want it to be like purely open. So I think what I'm going to do is some sort of slotted uh, window slots here, probably using some trim, using some trim bits, stuff like that. So I'm going to get working on that. Still gotta do a little bit of uh, trimming and fitting, but that's that's gonna work nice. face this off and finish this off. This looks really good. I'm really happy with that. And as well as doing that, I've made this cover, uh, what do you call it? Or a cutting board essentially, like a cutting board cover that uh, opens and closes over the actual oven. So that way, if he's not cooking yet, or if he needs a place to cut stuff, he has the, uh, the cutting board here. And then when he's ready, he just pops it up and he's like, oh yeah, burner, hell yeah. And I'll probably do the backside of this with stainless so that way the heat doesn't affect it. The upper pantry is almost done. We've got the RGB up in the ceiling as well. This is the spice rack that's all nice and finished and it's all RGB. I tested that out on uh, Instagram probably seen that the other day. I built this weird uh, like transition between the kitchen and the uh, in the office, you know? That's that looks really good. I, I completely redid this. It doesn't it probably doesn't look like it, but I've completely re redone this. I've built this uh, this downward dam here so when the AC unit shoots the air downwards, it'll shoot it out evenly across and out there. Yeah, it's just like here and there, it's just piece after piece. It's it's been the best I can do with how I've been injured. Got that all put up there. That looks really good. It's a good scene. And now I'm going to hop back into uh, where I, the whole reason I grabbed the camera today is because I think what I wanna go ahead and do is I wanna go ahead and put this wall up here. And like, this is the stuff I really have been not wanting to do. I hate doing panels, uh, mostly because it's like very little room for error. So if you fuck up a little bit on a panel, it's kind of like you've ruined this whole big piece, right? So I, I think that's probably why I don't like doing them. Not to mention that this piece is gonna have some steps. So instead of, I can't just make a big square piece because and then it won't fit in this little gap here. So what I'll probably do is I'll measure it out here and here and then measure out here and then there and then from here to here. It's a pretty simple step. There's a lot of tools that I can use for this if I want to be 100% accurate, but I think I'm just going to do the old fashioned do it damn way and do it by eye.
All right, you guys saw the way I measured everything. I squared everything to make sure it was nice and perfect, uh, both horizontally and vertically, which means that this piece should go up right away first try. Y'all saw me just look, there's still sawdust on it. Y'all know, Ugh, look at that edge. But y'all know I hadn't put it up there yet. That's how confident I am in this. So let's do it. Sawdust and shit still on it, all right. We're about to first try this bitch, I promise you. All right, look, sawdust still on it, so I'm gonna blow it off. Okay. Uh, sawdust still on it, fresh. I mean, you know, damn, Daniel, not bad, not bad. I probably need to bring it up a little bit off the ground, which we will when the floors are in, but damn, Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Do you guys remember Vine? <sighs> okay. Okie dokie, that's a bathroom, Batman. All right, I got all the doors closed. I mean, there's no light in here, obviously, right now, but this is the weird part is like when when you've been working on something for a while now and it starts to like literally come together like this is now a room before it was just you know just hollow it was just a space with boards and now it's actually like a room it's it's crazy how different it feels yeah i wish i was moving a little bit faster but like right now I can, it's like my body and mind can only handle so much but this i like this but this is brilliant. Jeremy Clarkson, anybody? Okay, anyway. Uh, another thing I've been doing is underneath the water tank, I went ahead and uh, mounted these. Fuck, Icon, thanks for the water tank, by the way. I don't know if I ever said thank you. But, so I put these boards underneath the water tank. That's just gonna keep it off the ground, or and level. This one's a little bit taller than that one since the ambulance is naturally at an incline uh, towards the rear that bounces out the water levels. But I put this, RGB strip that goes all the way underneath it That's going to shine up through the tank and I'm gonna put a little window on the edge of the bed So for you to see your water levels all you gotta do is look at it neat, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm a god the god of light is there is there a uh, is there if there was a god if there was a, a god of light You know, I mean I, I know that talking about like Norse gods. Is there a god of light? Loki's a god of mischief the world's a god of thunder. I'm the god of light Got a wee bathroom here Gonna walk into my bathroom. Bazanga. Oof, just gonna take a wee shit. Ow. Gonna take a wee shit right here. Cool. Oh wow, look at that, the end of the video. Wow, wow. Do I sound like Owen Wilson? Wow. Hey, uh, so this is just like me talking at the end of the video. I haven't done this in a minute. Um, hope you guys are good. I hope you guys are having a good time. I hope you're you're doing well. I hope all your friends and family are uh, are doing well. I hope they think positive of you. And uh, I hope you drown in success. I mean that. I, I genuinely mean that. Um, also, if you've made it this far, you know, I want to say that I'm probably going to be changing the way I do stuff on the channel. If you notice, I took like a couple days off. Man, it's been fucking nuts, right? Like how much stuff has been going on with uh, with the channel and the shop and trying to build stuff. I've been, I've been doing a lot of stuff on the ambulance while not recording it. I've been in my own head about it and I'm just, I'm just going to change the way I do stuff. I... I always talk about, you know, when it comes to work, just do it. Well, that's what it is. It's just do it. It's part of recording stuff and part of editing is just work. And uh, I'm going to be better about that. It's It's been kind of, uh, kind of suck not recording everything. There's so much stuff that I've done that I haven't recorded. And I, and I want to kind of change the way I record that stuff too. So just, you know, just throwing this at the end of the video. I hope you're doing good. I hope, uh, I hope you come back and watch the next video when it comes out. And I appreciate you and I love you. And I will see you in the next one. Okay.